My name is Kathy Buxbaum, and I'm the Assistant Director at the Limbrook Public Library. So I just wanted to show you that we have a new website, semi-new, but there's a lot of great new resources on there that I want to make sure that everybody is aware of at the Limbrook community. So when you look at our website, we have About Us, which brings you all about the general information about the library, if you have questions, if you want to know what the library board is doing, if you want to see our long-range plan or our annual report to the community, that's right under that tab. And then one amazing tab is our events. We have so many wonderful events at the library. You can go into more detail on our events tab that shows you the library calendar, the newsletters, the special programs that we might be having, and the community service, and of course, a thousand books before kindergarten. Every kindergartner should be reading as much as possible. And then just on our general page, we always have our upcoming events. That's anything that's coming up in the next week. It tells you detailed times, how you can register for events, what's happening, what movies are playing, so many wonderful things that you could do here at the library. If you keep going down, we have lots of services that we offer too. We have a digital library card. So if you don't have your library card yet, you can get one right now on the website. You just click get a digital library card and you fill out your information and in your email you'll have a library card within 24 hours, 48 if it's the weekend. We have museum passes available. This tells you everything, all the different museums that we have. You can go to the Intrepid, you can go to the Guggenheim and all of this is paid for already. You just have to check out a pass. Call up the library and reserve it up to two weeks in advance and you can get a pass to go to the Cradle of Aviation or the Long Island Children's Museum and so many more. There's also all our online resources. We have the NASA Digital Doorway, Libby, where you can get audiobooks and ebooks. We have Reader's Advisory and lots of different suggestions for things to read. We have career and job resources and information about our library telescope. So if you want to stare at the night sky and you don't have a telescope of your own, you could borrow ours. Then we have story time videos, all our different videos that all our librarians make to have fun and hear some new books. And then we have our wonderful community tab where it tells you what's going on this month at the library or maybe what's going on this week. Also the community directory, so if you need to know the mayor's information or the deputy mayor or the Limbrook Recreation or sanitation, you can get that through our community directory. We have our local history area where you can learn all about the history of Limbrook. We have the Incorporated Village of Limbrook website and also we have the Limbrook TV YouTube channel. So if you want to see this program again right away, just click on that and you'll see all the programs that the Limbrook TV channel has. New programs and programs for the past years too. So if you had a special event in Limbrook and Limbrook TV was there, you'll be able to find it on their site, the Limbrook T YouTube channel. Also then we have our research tab where you can look up articles that you might need for research or maybe new books that you're interested in or maybe you're looking for a phone number. That's where you'll find it. And then we have our catalog. So do you want to read the hot new title that's out there? Maybe you're interested in The Woman by Kristen Hanna, but it's all checked out. So you can place a hold on it. The easiest way to start it is to find the book that you're looking for. So I'm going to put in the title right up here in our search menu. And it's going to show me all these versions of the book. Oh look, the book's available somewhere, but not in Limbrook, so I'm gonna have to place a hold. I just go right to this little tab over here, I press place hold, and I'm gonna have to sign into my library account. To do that, you need your library card number and your PIN. Your PIN is whatever you decided what it would be. But if you have trouble, you don't remember it, you can call back to the library and we can reset it for you, or you could do forget pin and the email will help you reset it too. But I think I remember mine. Let's find out. Did I? Fingers crossed. 
I did, woohoo! Now I'm gonna place a hold because I want to read the book and Limerick doesn't happen to have a copy right now. I click place hold. I want to pick it up at Limbrook, of course. And then I'm going to confirm the location. And now it's just working on it. It was successful. So now I'll get an email when it's ready for pickup. It's so simple. You have five days to pick it up, whether you get an email or a phone call. And then you'll be ready to read. I hope you can place a hold on any item that you want. And if you're having too much trouble with the computer, you can always call us too. Call us anytime the library is open and we're very happy to request an item for you. And if you can't find an item in the catalog at all, we have other options to request items that might be outside of the Nassau system. So make sure you ask the librarians about that too. One of my favorite resources that's really fun, if you click on research, because I'm into crafting, I like to make things. And you find this little menu on the side, you would hit crafts and it's going to bring you to this great resource. It's called Creative Bug. It's a do-it-yourself crafter's videos. And all you need is your library card. You would put your library card up number in right here. And you'd log in. And welcome, Pageant of Limburg Public Library, that's me. You could pick up where you left off. You can learn how to make a rainbow quilt, a leather cuff, lots of different things. There's so many things. You could see new releases of new videos that are coming up. Maybe you want to learn different types of sketchbooks or there's so many classes that you can do. Make a paper mache vase. There's make a floral crown. There's so many learned how to sew a rainbow vest. There's wonderful things. Maybe you just want to practice daily some creative skills. That's a tab too. There's lots of different things on here if you're into crafting and you could all do it yourself. It's very simple and all you need is your library card to do it. I hope you'll check it out on our research page on our website. That's limbricklibrary.org. Research and look for Creative Bug. I hope you'll use our website and check it out. And if you have any questions, right on top, there's a tab that you can say that says contact us. When you click on that, you fill out a form and that email will come to me or the director and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. We always love suggestions. If you have a book that you want and we don't have it, if there's a program that you're interested in, if you just like the library and you want to share some good cheer, we'd love to hear from you. So thank you so much for listening and I hope you use the Limbrook Library website. That's limbrooklibrary.org. My name's Kathy Buxbaum and I can't wait to see you at the library.